how it happened. This is how the Joker died. Nine months ago, Joker was cremated. I pressed the button and burnt the evil bastard myself. And then, we waited. Gotham braced itself for the inevitable power struggle. But it didn't come. Crime actually fell. Deep down, I knew war was coming. I was just waiting for someone to pull the trigger. Thanks. No problem. Oh, thanks, honey. So, what'll it be? Your usual? Sure. Okay, chicken salad with no dressing. <laughs> no, you know what? Make it waffles. With a side of bacon. Don't tell my wife. Whatever you say, officer. Oh, and if you want some more coffee, just shout. Hey, I'm sorry to interrupt your dinner, Officer uh, Owens. There's a guy smoking over there in the corner booth. <sighs> Wait here. I'll have a word. Check that guy out. He's down the back. Excuse me, sir. There's no smoking in here. used just five ounces of my latest toxin. Tomorrow, this will seem like child's play. Gotham. 
them. This is your only warning. Scarecrow's threat worked. Yesterday, there were 6.3 million people in Gotham City. Today, not so many. The only people left on the streets are the sort that enjoy the chaos. <laughs> Gotham's finest. Scum. Criminals. And worse. Not enough good people left to stop them. It took just 24 hours for us to lose control of the city. Tonight, Gotham's relying on one man to save us all. Still know how to make an entrance. How's the evacuation going? Last bus crossed the city limits an hour ago. I'm just glad my little girl got out when she did. Now the real work begins. Any lead on Scarecrow? We were tracking an unknown military vehicle speeding through Chinatown. It's the only lead we've had all night, but they gave us the slip. With the evacuation, I just don't have the manpower left in the city. If you find it, tell your men not to engage. I'll deal with it. Do you really think Scarecrow's crazy enough to detonate a chemical weapon in Gotham? I won't let that happen, Jim. In case you need to reach me, it's going to be a long night. All units, we've got a 1033 in Sector 2. Missing patrol car. Unit 247. Suspected officer down. Hey, Batman. Every damn time. Oracle, I need the location of Unit 247. Already working on it. How's my dad doing? He's holding up. Somehow, he always does. Okay, I'm sending through the squad car's location. Be careful. It's not looking good out there. Brought the 
this on yourself, trying to be a hero. <laughs> Please. Frank. You're safe. Thanks, Batman. I thought they were gonna kill me. The city's overrun. We don't stand a chance. Stay here. I'll send someone to pick you up. What are you doing? Evening the odds. That military vehicle. A squad car has picked up the pursuit. I'm relaying its location now. Call off your men, Jim. Golf Oscar 5 6, this is Commissioner Gordon. I'm calling off the pursuit. It's too dangerous. Sir, we're right here. We can take these bastards. What the? They just fired an RPG at us! Who the hell are these guys? 5-6, pull back now. That's an order. Let Batman deal with this. 5-6 has taken a direct hit from an RPG. They're gone, sir. Please, Batman, you've got to stop them. Don't worry, Jim. He's mine. That takes care of the vehicle. I need to interrogate the driver and find out what he knows. Nothing to say to you, Batman. Talk, or I'll crush every bone in your body. Okay, okay. Uh, he's working out of a penthouse in Chinatown. I swear that's all I know. If you're lying, I'll break the other one. The other one? Oracle, check the chemical analysis I've just uploaded. Sure. Is this what I think it is? Scarecrow's new toxin. An uncontaminated sample. You're not kidding. I'll prepare a full chemical breakdown on the back computer. What are you going to do? Scarecrow's got a safe house nearby. I'm going to pay him a visit. Let's hope this is the break we've been waiting for. This is the place. I should check the penthouse on the top floor. How long do we keep her in there? Until we get the order to gas her. Do your worst. The boredom is killing me. Oh, don't worry. You'll get what's coming to you when we're good and ready. Why do we have to wait? We can give her a dose now. Be my guest. I'll tell Scarecrow it was your idea. I was just joking. Didn't sound like a joke. Would you think I wanted to know I was going against orders? Have you seen him? Yeah, up close. He's done something to his face, hasn't he? Looks like he's taken a knife and cut chunks out of it. Rumor is he got his face torn off by some freak called Killer Croc. Really? Looks deliberate to me. Yeah, well, I guess he figured he should look the part. You know, like a scarecrow. That's messed up, man. Speaking of messed up. 
messed up. Why is she here? I am here because your boss has an inferiority complex. After all, he's only human. Nobody asked you, freak. They offered her the chance to join. She said no. Scarecrow's gonna use her as his new lab rat. Pamela Isley. Able to control plants with her mind. Really? Stick around and maybe you'll find out. I've seen it with my own eyes. One of the guys who brought her got torn in two by some giant tentacle. You make it sound so crass. It was... beautiful. Man, what's wrong with this city? It's just full of freaks. You are not wrong. Check Compressor 5. We need to be ready to go when we get the order. What are you doing here? Why did Scarecrow lock you up? No hello. Tell me. And what if I don't want to? Then I burn every plant in Gotham. It started with a meeting. What meeting? Everyone was there. Penguin, Two-Face, Riddler, even poor Harley. Scarecrow said he had a plan. That together we could take you out, and Gotham would be ours. Over my dead body. I believe that was the idea. I told him that I wasn't interested in his pathetic human games. And when I came to, I was locked up in that room. It's such a shame that his vile toxin has no effect on me. Nature always wins. Will he ever learn? <sighs> You're coming with me. You only had to ask. What's wrong? Target, sir. He's cornered. Don't move. Are you sure it's him? Confirmed. It's Batman. Sir, that tank they have backing them up is unmanned. Good. I thought this would be tough. Well, it took a tank. And we brought an army to take you on. What a waste. This is it, boys. What everyone's afraid of. Operational. Riot's 
suppressor engaged. Batman, I've spotted six more unmanned tanks moving to Chinatown. They'll be there any second. to leave the master of understatement as ever oh, I need to know where those tanks are coming from I'm tracking several transport helicopters moving into the city there are more on the way activate the Batmobile weapon diagnostics it's time to go to war Batman, I'm seeing a transport deploying more tanks at Panessa Studios. I've warned GCPD to pull their men off the streets. I'm heading there now. Come in, all units. This is Commissioner Gordon. We have numerous hostile tanks deployed across the city. Gotham is under attack. I want everyone off the streets and back to GCPD. We're not equipped to deal with what's out there. Thank God there's someone who is. they can resume their patrols. The tanks have been dealt with. Thank God. Let's hope they were the last. Don't count on it. I need the isolation chamber prepped at the GCPD lockup. I'm bringing in Ivy. Progress with the fear toxin analysis. It's gonna take a little while longer. Drop by the clock tower when you're ready, and I'll show you what I've got so far. Who taught you to drive? Scarecrow's gonna break you, Batman. Honestly, why do you even bother with these meat sacks? Civil unrest? 
There's a war on the streets. We don't have the manpower or the equipment. Well, look who it is. Ivy. Well, that's one less thing to worry about. Is the isolation chamber ready? Glad you're putting it to good use. Oh, good. Another cell. Batman. I can see it in your eyes. You're afraid. You can't lock me in here like some human. You have my word that each and every one of you will be commended when this is over. But the work starts now. Priority one, we're here to save lives, and it starts with the lives of your fellow officers right here at this precinct. Come on, answer the phone, damn it. Rachel? Can you hear me? If you ask me, we should use some of these weapons instead of letting them gather dust. Might even things up a little. God knows we could use the help. Ventriloquist dummy, a.k.a. Scarface. This ain't the original Scarface. It's a Joker knockoff. Don't ask me why, but the clown took a liking to these creepy things. One stuffed bear in a canister of Titan formula. Owned by Bane, a.k.a. Unknown. <sighs> we had to let Bane loose after the Arkham City fallout. Guy was messed up anyway. Serious Titan withdrawal. My guess, he's off somewhere getting clean. And he's not going to be happy when he comes back. One vial of Titan formula. One set of wind-up explosive false teeth. One pair of actual X-ray specs. One toy gun loaded with one toy flag and five real bullets. All used by the Joker. No known alias. It's one hell of a toy box. I'm glad no one's gonna play with it again. One custom tailored top hat, worn by Jervis Tetch, AKA the Mad Hatter. Guy's mad, all right. He tried to brainwash Batman in Arkham City. <laughs> he got the Wonderland kicked out of him instead. I hated letting him go. This guy's too creepy to stay free. A selection of body parts belonging to Warren White, a.k.a. the Great White Shark. White got himself sent to Arkham on an insanity plea. He lost a few things other than his mind while there. Made the new look work, though, I gotta say. One freeze ray used by Mr. Freeze, a.k.a. Victor Freeze. We, uh, had to stop playing with this after the Commissioner caught us making ice cream. Freeze has kept quiet since leaving Arkham City. Maybe Batman finally talked some sense into him. One electric charge gun used by Batman, a.k.a. We don't like to ask. Batman dropped this here with the rest of the Arkham City evidence. Nice to have some of Batman's gear in the evidence room. Obi doesn't ask for it back. the electrocutioner, a.k.a. Lester Buczynski. Joker hired this guy on the night of the Black Gate riots, and then he killed him. I heard Batman borrowed these for a while before handing them in. 
I guess he prefers beating up punks the old-fashioned way. One mask and jacket worn by Anarchy, a.k.a. Lonnie Machen. I wasn't even a cop when this kid tried to hit Gotham. No one's seen him since. No one knows where they're keeping him. I guess the government don't like anarchists too much. One Tommy gun, used by Peyton Riley, a.k.a. the ventriloquist. Or maybe the gun belongs to the puppet. I never really understood what's going on there. Talia. I'm sorry. One ceremonial sword owned by Talia Al Ghul. Miss Al Ghul was a wanted terrorist and an associate of her father, Raish. But Joker got to her before we did. From what I hear, Batman put this blade to good work after she died. One black mask worn by Black Mask, a.k.a. Roman Sionis. Sionis never really recovered from the night of the Black Gate riots, the night Joker showed up. Roman was an old-school gangster. Joker, well, I'm not sure what he was. One laughing gas grenade, one snare trap, and one baseball bat, all used by Dr. Harleen Quinzel. A.K.A. Harley Quinn, during a recent assault on the Bloodhaven police station. From what we gather, Scarecrow sent Harley to break out Poison Ivy from the lockup in blood. One rifle and two wrist-mounted guns used by Floyd Lawton, A.K.A. Deadshot. Another guy we had to let go after Arkham City got shut down. Still, that doesn't mean he got his toys back. One Arkham Asylum branded shock collar, worn by Killer Croc, AKA Waylon Jones. We found this thing in the sewers under Arkham City. And that ain't good, cause it was supposed to keep that bastard under control. Two ceremonial swords used by Rosh, I mean, Raish Al Ghul. We found these at the bottom of Wonder Tower the night of Protocol 10. They were covered in blood. No body, though. I can't believe how quickly everything's changed. I was doing a normal shift on a normal day, and, and now this. Okay, I'm gonna run through this one more time so we're clear. Priority one, we're here to save lives. And it starts with the lives of your fellow- This elevator's locked down, Batman. Only way in or out is through the parking garage. ...roof at all times, and a six-man element patrolling the perimeter. Keep this building locked down. The only people who get in or out are our guys and the Batman. We have outlying patrols searching for Scarecrow in Bristol, Kingston. I've heard these excuses before, sir. We just haven't got the men to deal with all this. I don't know where to start. It's hopeless. We can't deal with what's going on out there. I've got men down and I can't help them. I've got men dying down here.
Screw you. Damn bureaucrats. We're on our own. We can handle it, Jim. What's the latest? We've got incidents cropping up all over the city. Cash, give us a rundown. All right, let's see. First up, we've lost contact with the fire crew from Station 17. We've got their last known coordinates, but they're not going to survive out there on their own for long. Then there's this. It's a strange one. Body turned up. We didn't have long to look before the evacuation, but the forensics boys seem freaked out. Real nasty. Also, we've had several sightings of the Riddler creeping around the train yard. Knowing that guy, he's got to be up to no good. Look, I know you're busy, but anything you can do to help is going to save lives. Don't worry, Jim. I have someone working a lead on Scarecrow. I'll see what I can do. Good to hear. I've got a skeleton crew searching Gotham South and West. I'm gonna join him when I'm done here. We're gonna find that son of a bitch. Fernandez, it's Gordon. Give me an update. I'll look into these later. Scarecrow's the priority. Good luck out there, Batman. Okay. Never seen him up close before. We've got you back in here, Batman. All of us. Well, Owens from the diner probably wants you dead, but everyone else? Team Batman. Gordon's crazy going out there. You really think you're gonna convince him to stay? This city's his home, where he raised his family. He'd die for that. Yep, poor bastard. He ain't gonna be able to live with himself when he finds out what he did in that diner. He's gonna lose his badge for sure. Owens is a good cop, lives for the job. He don't deserve this. Paramedics say there's nothing we can do for him. Just pray. Hey, Batman! I guess Scarecrow gave you the slip! You broke my wrist for nothing! He's got plans for you, Batman! You and all your friends! Tonight's the night we finally break the bat! Ooh. I've never seen anything like this, man. Even Gordon looks worried. Nothing scares that guy. It was too quiet for too long. They were planning it, biding their time. That's all we've been hearing on the news is how great Gotham is. Gotham is cured, zero crime. What did we all do? We lapped it up. We should have known better. Gotham's as sick as it ever was. Batman, just want to say it's good to have you on board. I still keep seeing that car coming for us, Batman. I was like a rabbit in the headlights. This thing's had a serious upgrade. Air support saw it turn into some kind of tank. Nice. Don't get too close. He's here. Back up. Actually, Lucius, he's a little sluggish. I had a feeling you'd say something like that. Give me a few moments, and I'll bring the afterburner function online. Thanks, Lucius. It was good of you to stay behind. You want to thank me, Mr. Wayne? Just try not to hurtle off the road. I should have some more upgrades ready soon. Remnants of Gotham, I have messages for you all. Vandals who stayed behind to pick the still warm flesh. 
knowledge from Goblin to Bone. Have your fun. You are under my protection. To the cowards quaking behind the police department's walls, you will not be spared. And to Batman, I have already won. Emptied your city with a vial of toxin and a few threatening words. That's how little the safety you provided was worth. And when the dawn comes, when Gotham lies in ruin and I turn my gaze to the world beyond, the legend of the Batman will be worth nothing at all. Do I come in the Batcave, start messing with all your stuff? You've managed to reduce the compound to its core elements. But there's nothing in there that we can trace. What if we'd been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of searching for the toxin, what if we focus on the manufacturing process? Why didn't I see this? The reaction emits a unique radiation spike. Run a scan of the city for this energy signature. It will show where Scarecrow is creating his fear toxin. It'll take a few hours to bring the satellites into position. We don't have enough time. I'll repurpose the antenna at the movie studios. Bruce, I spoke to Dad. I hate lying to him. He'd kill me if he knew I was still in the city. He still blames himself for this. We'll stop, Scarecrow. Jim, we've got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your men ready. Soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. All right. Generation. 
generator's damaged. I need to bypass it and power the antenna directly. Hello again, Mr. Wayne. How can I help you this time? Is the power winch ready for deployment? It's 100% functional. Though no guarantees if you're intending to pull that car of yours up the side of a building. You read my mind. It's in the job description, Mr. Wayne. Batwing's on its way. I'll improvise. The winch needs a secure anchor point to function. Once it's attached, just hit reverse. And please be careful with the car, Mr. Wayne. She's one of a kind. Restored power to the radio antenna. Great. I'm connecting now. I was just talking to Robin. I think you should too. Bruce, you need me out there. We can find Scarecrow faster together. What you're working on is more important, Tim. Can wait one night. Let me help. I've got this under control. <sighs> okay. 
Listen, try checking in once in a while. We're partners, remember? He just wants to help, you know. Is the antenna ready? Yeah, but we're going to need a microwave tower to triangulate Scarecrow's location. There's one at Falcone shipping in the cauldron. I've marked it on your map. Thanks, Oracle. Scarecrow's men are guarding the antenna. I need to evaluate the threat and plan my attack. If that happens, this whole operation... Five soldiers, all armed. If I alert them, they'll kill the hostage. Plan in case the bat shows up. If I can separate them, they'll be easier to take down. soldiers inside. They think they're safe if they stick together. Lucius, I've got a hostage situation. Three gunmen. I need to take them all out before they can react. Is it ready? Flexible plates over an MR fluid armor layer. You'll move faster, hit harder, and look scarier while doing so. Send it, Lucius. Now. Already airborne, Mr. Wayne.
walk you through it. The outer and inner layers of the bodysuit are made of a titanium dip tri weave. It's between those layers where things get interesting. Wayne Tech MR fluid hardens in response to impact. With this kind of shock absorption, you'll be able to put more force into your counterattacks. The liquid armor is more flexible than the fibers you're accustomed to as well. You can use that increased maneuverability to take out multiple foes in quick succession. The suit's compatible with the Batmobile's electromagnetic eject mechanism, too. You'll fly out of that thing like a bullet from a railgun. Speaking of which, the new Grapno launcher will pull you skyward just as fast. Don't worry, Mr. Wayne. That suit can take the G's. How's it feel, Mr. Wayne? I've activated the AR training program should you want to run diagnostics or just break it in.